Hi. In this video, we will create new forms. Uh, you know, we start the new project and uh, we create some tables for our bookstore management project. Now we will create new forms for that uh, table. Let's look at our table. We have four tables right now. Uh, DMR category, DMR book category, book table and author table. First, let's create a category form. Now I'm right click and at new item form. Let's give a proper name. Okay, my form is uh, created and uh, now uh, I can see my methods, data source and design. First, I need to add a new data source. I can right click and uh, new, create a new data source or I can drag and drop my table to the data source and it creates data source for me. Okay, I create new data source and I need to create a, a design. Uh, this is a, a simple uh, form, so I can use a simple list pattern. Uh, let's uh, look at the patterns. As you can see, we have lots of patterns here, and now I have a simple list pattern. And when I uh, when I add this pattern, it needs some uh, specific uh, elements. Uh, one application bar, one customer field group, one uh, simple list grid. So let's create new action pane and create new action pane tab and new button group for this first. And it's now uh, created. Now I need a custom uh, field group. Let's create a new group and apply custom uh, and quick filters to this one and new uh, quick filters field. Okay, we created first two. Now we need grid. Let's new and grid. In grid, we need to select data source. Uh, you don't, you, you always need to select data source for grid. Now my grid is ready and I can and drag and drop my field to grid. And we have category name field to in, in our grid. Uh, our form is actually ready. Uh, let's give a caption. And maybe the titles. Uh, title data source and okay if we did everything correctly it it will work let's rebuild our solution after uh, after this we will create menu items for our form and we will see how the form is working and build completed. Okay, let's create uh, menu items for uh, this form. Create new menu item. And it must be display. Now I, I have created a DMR category menu item and this menu items property, I need to select my object here, DMR category. Okay, now it's ready for us. Let's go back to solution and rebuild again. If everything is fine, uh, then we will uh, see. Okay, build is completed. Now right click and set a startup object and start to run. Okay, my form is opened. Now you can see we have uh, buttons here and our grid is here. Uh, we can create new, for example, uh, new categories and also we can delete this and okay. Now our form is ready. 
as you can see, it's very simple to create simple uh, forms, of course. Next videos, we will create uh, other uh, forms and other type of forms. Also, we will uh, write some codes, uh, some validation or some uh, controls for these forms too. I hope it will help you. Uh, thank you for watching.